Hello everybody and welcome back to more Nuclear Throne Ultra. We are jumping in again and this time I'm going to run as good old Crystal. We like Crystal. Um, and then starting weapon we've got plenty to choose from so we'll keep it at random. Um, and we get Flare Gun. Honestly, Flare Gun is such an insane one to start with. I think Flare Gun might be my favourite one to start with. Um, it just, it has some insane power and like its radius and the fact that as you just saw there, the, the, the shot can go through walls and stuff. It just... It makes it very, very good. Um, shotgun as a secondary there. Nice. I like it. Good stuff. Very good first stage. Got to remember to use our ability with this guy as well. In fact, let's get alien testing so that our ability is more valuable to use and does some damage when we do use it. Be very, very nice. It will indeed. But yes, very glad to be back on some Nuclear Throne. First recording back after the new year. And oh, lord. This game... It's just, it's just something else. It's just something else. Like, this, this this mod just breathes so much life into this game. Oopsie, that was my bad. So much life. Hello, good sir. And you are dead. Bouncer revolver. Is there anything else on the stage? No, no, no. Okay, um... About double higher max ammo, minor ammo drop rate increase. Um, let's go with Last Wish. I've been, I've been getting told that Last Wish is, like, always something I should be taking, so I will take that advice. Just because it's a revive and stuff, it makes it a lot better. So I will take that advice and do exactly that. Oh, fire through the gap. Oh, I can't goddamn hit this guy. There you go. Wow, that killed everything all the way over here. My goodness. There's a lot of these big gator dudes around right now. What the fuck's that about? I'm not quite sure where they're all coming from. Seems to be every every now and again you just get a stage that's absolutely full of them. Like, look at this, there's like four of them here. Amazing. Oh, I missed out on all that stuff, you kidding? Um, let's have a little look-see here. I think Enriched Metabolism is going to be pretty good here for defense. We've already got higher HP, so we can go for a very defensive build here. And try and see how that works for us. I mean, normally high defense is better than offense in this game. From what I found, because your, your offense obviously mainly just comes from whatever good weapons you get. So, you can stay relatively... High DPS without taking too many upgrades that specifically affect it. Right, let's use the shotgun for now here. There you go, we've got an inverted area over here as well, nice. Director shotgun, we'll take that, it's a little bit better. Not much back over there, we'll leave that for now. Right. <clears throat> Take the inverted area. See what's going on over here. All your bouncing projectiles bounce further. Shells deal splash damage. Shells cannot be deflected. Mm, I kind of like the idea of that, to be honest. I mean, I like shotgun shoulders anyways, but the splash damage from shotgun ones specifically seems interesting. They're like slightly explosive. We can't use the flare gun all day, every day. Okay. Is that shotgun on top of that? No, that's uh, HP and ammo drop. I'll take it. Okay, cool. Through here as well. Got a mutation, I like that. Uh, we're not going to take a crown for now. I'll take a crown. I, I like to take crowns a bit later on. I think crowns early is a bit of a risk. Oh god, i got an itchy nose all the time with the itchy nose when I'm playing this game. When I'm playing any game, when I'm recording just in general, <laughs> my body betrays me. But yeah, we were looking for other better shotguns. This one's pretty good though. Director allowing us for that boost in speed. That was a really bad hit there. Okay. 
Can this sniper go away, please? Oh, dude, that's... Uh, how do I avoid this mini missile here? Yeah, yeah, okay, that's that's. <laughs> right, that sniper ruined everything there. Get out of here. <laughs> My god. Um, we'll take Rhino skin now for that extra HP. I think we have now used our revive as well. I'm liking turning things into sheep. That's always fun. Flame director shotgun. Now, that's the sort of thing that we're looking for. That's a nice upgrade. Flame pop gun. Also really good for bouncy bullets. We've got a, a flaming setup going on right now. Inverted area here. Inverted area here is kind of sketchy, but I will risk it. What on earth is that? Sextuple Blood Rifle seems probably like a good idea, to be honest, for uh, staving off difficult shots. Okay, the lasers still go through my armor. I've got to remember that. Oh, you're a mimic. Lovely to know. I like having double HP and ammo drop on this. Seems like it could be pretty darn useful. Basically, whenever I hit an enemy like that, you can see ammo can drop, HP can drop. Not when we kill them, it's when we specifically hit them. Pretty good. <laughs> Through here. Oh, wait, we don't have double, of course, because we already had... Yeah, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Um... Enemies don't attack you for a couple of seconds at the start of the floor. IDPD and bosses spawn in Sleepy. I don't really know. I think I'm going to go with Eagle Eyes. Bouncer. Take Bouncer. What the? What was this little dude? Listen. Rush to take your time. What? What does that mean? Rush to take your time? I'm confused. I'm disoriented. I don't know anything. Oh, eagle eyes with this is mental. Get out of here, you police scum. Explosive on that as well. Right. It looks amazing. It's like a flamethrower, doesn't it? It uses a hell of a lot of ammo, though. But I think it's worth it for the defensive capabilities that thing has. We'll keep it around. You can't rely on it, because, yeah, the ammo is just crazy on it. This shotgun's amazing. I'm liking this a lot. Heavy shovel. Heavy shovel, you say? Car-wielding maniac over here. HP there. Good, good. Right. Head on through here. What would we like to take? Plutonium hunger is very good. I would like that, I think. Rage is also quite nice. Tough shell. Oh, that that goes to 15 HP. That's that's pretty nutty, I think. Um, I think instead of bouncer, I'm going to take herming and see how that works. Right. Next time we go to a crown vault, I will take a, a crown if I can.
Okay, this is definitely a job for this gun. Yeah. <laughs> that made that guy a piece of piss. We're getting through most of these enemies pretty easily. Toxic Ion Cannon is interesting, but not really something I want right now. I wonder what the blue bar on my HP means. I'm not actually sure what that is. I think it's to do with my revives, but I'm not actually sure. Is that it? There you go. That's it. Okay, these guys seem like they're going to be annoying considering they're not dying in a single burst like I expected them to. Okay, let's not use all the ammo there. Oh, I think I think that means my next hit's negated if my health's blue. I think that just means that uh, my whatever it's called item negates every third hit is going to be active on that next hit. That's good. That's good to know. I didn't realize it. Yeah, yeah. It is it, exactly that. That's really good to know that. Man, this, this shotgun's definitely fallen off a little bit, so we're going to have to find a better shotgun soon. Health dispenser. Cool. Yeah, we're probably going to have to uh, replace that fairly shortly, which is annoying because we have a lot of weapon mods on it, but it's just not really cutting it right now. I mean, it's, it's, it's doing an okay job, but using a bit too much ammo to kill one enemy, I think. Throne butt, 75% longer shield. We don't really shield for very long, so that's not super useful. Burst weapons. Um... Hmm. Yeah, that doesn't really do much for us. Trigger fingers, I think, is always a good take, so we'll take that. Look at that guy. That guy should have died to that, realistically. Right, we're going to have to deal with a big boss here, which is why I'm saving up my ammo for my uh, blood gun. I think we can demolish him with that. Okay. We've got a pretty defensible build here, though. I'm liking this. I think we could go the distance here. Unfortunately, his range is actually not great. Okay, actually, this, this weapon kind of sucks, you know, because it stops all of those bullets rather than deleting them, of course, which causes us more problems than it's worth. Okay, we got through it, but just about. Frost the bullet shotgun. Now that is bullet ammo, though. It does seem to be doing a better job for us, though. Right, who's left? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep this. I'm sorry, other gun, but... The only thing at the minute is ammo is a concern. I need to find a real shot. Okay. Okay, ammo's a major concern. Oops. We might be a bit screwed here. <laughs> I don't realize it was quite this bad. Oh, we just did just hit ultra, which is nice. Bouncer crash. Oh, it's the same fucking type of weapon as well. God damn it. This is not great. <sighs> Ultra. 
plus six max HP. Um, shorter shield, shoot while shielded, while stationary, increase reload speed. Deflected projectiles, hermit and enemies, and vulnerable. I think I'm just going to take the HP. It seems boring, but goddamn. This is bad. This is real bad. Okay, flail is pretty good. Luckily, flail is pretty good. Excuse me? I was shielded? That guy can apparently hit you while you're shielded. Good to know. So we've unfortunately got, re got our level reset right before the boss, which is not good. We lost all of our mutations. Yeah, I'm not, not happy about this. Oh, God. We got the boss here as well. I'm a level 3, God damn it. Um, I'm still going to take that. That was good. I'm still going to take that. That was good. Quadruple flame director shotgun. I'm going to take that. This, this this could be bad in terms of ammo, so we'll, we'll, we'll see how this goes. But the flail is just kind of meh. Let's just hope for the best here. One moment. Duh, 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 duh. I don't want to waste any ammo on shooting him. <laughs> yeah, this thing doesn't seem to be doing a hell of a lot. And I don't have the accuracy anymore, so this thing's not as good. Okay, that's all out now. Yep, not looking good. We're going to have to retreat back and get our flail. Oh god, I didn't realize he just chased you. Fuck, okay, we're so fucked here. Yeah, that was never going to happen. That's annoying. God, that was such a good run as well. I can't believe that guy just jumped on me while I was shielded. I thought that would have protected me. I don't, I'm guessing shielding only protects you from projectiles, maybe? I really don't know. Oh, good. Golden disc gun this time. What a bit of fun. Don't really want to go in there yet, but... We're here now. That didn't hit you, excuse me. Straight to level 2. Yeah. This gun, kind of good because its damage is extremely high. But the danger is... Uh, the danger is approaching. Ow. Oh, come on. It, it could have bounced like one more time. All oh, right. Back on the horse. Let's see how this goes. I'll take that because I think this does work with this. I think it does gain a small amount of homing. Yes, it does. Good. Makes it quite a bit more, quite a bit better and a little bit less deadly to us. Go through here, please. Um, that gives us homing as well. Charge bow, I'll take that. Oh wait, we went through and vault and inverted. That was weird. Yeah, I'm wondering if I get like extra extra homing now. This is kind of insane right now, to be honest. 
Like, this is doing us some real good. Okay, boss is in. It, it, he's dead. This might be disc gun supremacy, you know. This is the disc run. Alright, I'll be sticking with disc gun for the rest of this run now. Amazing. <laughs> this is this is wild. Right, now I just need defensibility. Um Nerves of Steel could be interesting. But I think I'm gonna go with Um Let's go with that. And take Last Wish again. Oh, we got so many levels here, what the hell? Um and strong spirit as well. Splinter Mace, I will take as a secondary. I don't know why there's mushroom people down here. What, wait a minute, where am I? Wait a minute, where am I? I don't recognize this place at all. Well, that was close. Okay, can the electric thing stop coming exactly down the path that I'm walking down, please? Dude. This is so difficult with these electric shots right now. That hit me? Oh my lord. No way I'm getting herming on this too. Okay. God damn, I'm so stressed right now. Health not good. Um... That, that seems pretty good, actually. Oh, we got new enemies down here that I haven't seen before. The gorilla guys. Okay. Disc gun supremacy is in a weird spot right now, but I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Fucking get out of here, you. This an inverted area? Yes, it is. I don't even know what these inverted enemies do, I'll be honest. Okay, they just, they're the same, but they fire purple bullets, which is a lot, lot worse. They can go through walls and stuff. Ow, I think I got hit by a disc there. I'm not actually sure, though. Okay, stop shooting through the walls, please. Do you know, I can't even see these guys. I can't even see them because of the the palette of this floor. When they're shooting, they, they like, go inside their own bullets. Barely see what's going on. Right, one HP at the moment. Oh lord, we're so unbelievably fucked here. I'm pretty sure we can't dodge the purple bullets either with our uh, with our active ability. Okay, that killed you at least. Why on earth was there no health in you? God damn. I did not realize my, my mace would use ammo. 
Um, herming, herming, frost. I think that's a good combo. Oh my god. <laughs> How am I at level 8 already? That- okay, this is problematic. It no longer kills things. When it's no longer killing stuff, there's problems. You can back off and all. Oh, my god, this is such a stressful run, but I'm enjoying it so much. <laughs> I've inflicted so much pain on myself here. Oh, this is still cursed, god damn it. Okay, got level 9, we're good to go. Um... What do we go for here? Rabbit's paw for more health drops. Oh my god. Stop moving towards me. I need my uh, blade to be able to hit you multiple times. Three blades for one enemy nowadays. It's a scam. Oh, that was a very stupid hit by me there. Okay. The frost is very nice. I'm liking that. We can kill one of those guys with one blade, but it has to bounce on them multiple times, which is not something we can super easily rely on. More ammo, thank you. Doom pistol. Oh, I still can't take it. It's still cursed. God damn it. Well, it looks like we're fighting the boss now. Flame director eraser. Would be good if we could take it, but we can't. But I've got to be really careful about the discs here, because they're going to bounce back at us. Oh, yes. They're going to bounce back at us in ways that's not too enjoyable. Try and fire them off at an angle so they go elsewhere. Once we're out of ammo, though, it's game over. Right, hold up for a minute. Just stay put. There you go. Good, we got him. We got Ultra. Still, yeah. Oh, cursed. Teleport after shielding. Shielding fires lasers. So is, is that our... Is that like a secret Ultra? I'm going to try that. Kind of interesting. I don't know how much I'm going to need to get this guy dead. How? That guy did a lot of damage to me then. Okay. We got max HP upon coming to this stage. I'm not quite sure why, but thank you. It's 
not a great ultra. I thought when it said fires lasers, I didn't expect it to just be like cardinal directions and diagonal. I thought it'd be like 360 degree around me sort of thing. Like, it's not enough lasers, unless the lasers do mad damage, which I, yeah, they, they do like six damage. <laughs> it's not, it's not a very good ultra. My god, this has been a crazy run. Told you. Disc supremacy. Sometimes you got to commit to the disc. Did almost just kill myself with it though, but ignore that. I just love the amount of herming that we managed to get this run. Like, the disc is so... It's the most herming it could possibly be. I mean, actually, technically we could get one more herming. Oh, what the hell? We could Technically, you could get one more thing of herming. How are you not dead, good sir? There you go, man. Insane. Insane to me you weren't dead there. Right. We're somehow still going. Oh, dude, these little maggots are the buggers right now. It's so hard to hit them. And there's so fucking many of them. Oh, I keep walking into my own discs, goddammit. That is the danger of disc gun, though. It's what we sign up for. Somehow, I'm still kicking. I'm still alive. That's a super toxic crossbow. Is the crossbow super and it's toxic, or is it super toxic? Okay. Fan peeps, you can go... Good bit of HP there, thank you. Yeah, it's kind of easy to avoid the discs for the most part when they don't bounce as much and the, um... Say that as I walk right into one. When they don't bounce as much and the, um... Herm more easily, because then they're not really bouncing directly back to you in the way that you fired them. Oh, damn it! Played that a little bit too risky, I think. Okay. Gatling Slugger I don't think we need right now. Oh, wait. We've lost a lot of our Herming abilities here. We've still got Herming on the weapon, but we've lost Bolt Marrow and Eagle Eyes. So, the, yeah, the Herming... It's not there, and I killed myself straight away. Anyways, that was a lot of fun. What a weird run. I hope you guys did enjoy that one. And yeah, see you guys in the next one.